Hey guys, welcome to Faith Woodworks. Today I'd like to talk to you about these router bits. So there are a lot of different type of router bits. Um, you can have different profile bits like this that actually uh, create different grooves and profiles and uh, boards. And you have straight cutting bits like this that are made for cutting grooves or dados or different things like that in a board. And then you also have different types of templating bits which allow the bearings to ride on a template to cut a specific pattern in whatever you're cutting on your boards. A lot of people start out with like a router bit set like this which has a whole bunch of different things from OG bits which is kind of a kind of Roman style pattern to to a chamfer bit like this where it just creates a 45 degree like uh, cutoff on the sides of your board. So there's definitely a lot of different shapes, a lot of different sizes, a lot of different ways that router butt bits can cut grooves and um, patterns into your wood. Today what I'd like to actually talk to you about more specifically are these router bits which I just picked up today from Harbor Freight and what they're actually for is creating molding now if you're like me like when you remodel a room in your house the last thing you want to do is spend a ton of money on molding and like when me and my wife actually remodeled our living room we ended up going with one by material just because it was easy to put down. It was cheap. Um, we could paint it and it worked great. But say you wanted a decorative pattern like we wanted at the top of our ceiling. Well then we actually had to buy some prefab molding from our big box store and that kind of molding is very expensive especially if you want solid wood. And so to cut down on costs, what I thought is in the future, we could use these molding bits to actually create our own molding and uh, save on some of those costs. So let's get started over here at the router table and chuck up one of these bits and see what it looks like.
So as you can see, the bed actually did a really decent job. Um, there's definitely a few burning marks in here from the router bit, but nothing horrible. And actually a little sanding will take that right out. For an inexpensive router bit set for doing moldings, it's definitely worth the money. So, would I recommend them? You bet. I would definitely re recommend going out to Harbor Freight, getting these router bits set, saving yourself some money, adding a little character to your projects in your home.